Yo guys, what is happening? Today we're doing a move called the pushover. Here is what it looks like. That's the move. Here is a slow-mo. To begin this move, you're going to start off holding the safe handle in your dominant hand. My thumb is about three quarters of the way up the safe handle. My four fingers are resting on the back. Uh, pretty standard. I'm going to begin by taking the back of the blade and flipping it over the back of my hand, like so. From here, what I'm going to do, I'm going to take my off hand and I'm going to place it in front of my body, like this, so that the back of my hand is facing towards the knife here. So once again, right, I've got the safe handle, flip it the blade over the back of my hand, palm goes down like so, and I'm going to take the bite handle and I'm going to fling it into my open palm, hitting right around where the knuckles would be on the other side of my hand. And I'm going to grab with my four fingers like so. So once again, right, got the safe handle, palm down, flip it out, hit the knuckles, grab. From here, what you're going to notice is my thumb is kind of pointing towards my body. What I'm going to do, I'm going to take this thumb on my off hand, I'm going to point it upwards, like so, right? So you catch, you take your thumb, which is pointing towards your body, you point it upwards. From here, what you're going to do is you're going to take your dominant hand, you're going to take your index finger, and you're going to curl it inwards so that the blade starts to point towards you, right? Just like so. What's going to happen is the blade is going to point towards you, and right when you get to about here, you're going to kind of Turn your hand in a way so you can do another kind of thumbs up with this hand. You don't actually have to do the thumbs up, but it'll kind of help you as a cue to know when you're in the right spot, right? When you can move your thumb up and you're in the thumbs up position. So what that'll look like is something like this. And the blade ends up on top of my hand, like so. So it goes from pointing straight down towards me to on top. You'll notice um, my other hand is just holding loosely, right? It just twists and it kind of does a little bit of backwards tilt, something like that, in order to allow this motion to happen. And so, palm towards you, hit, thumbs up, blade towards you, on top, thumbs up. From here, what you're going to do is you're going to take your off hand, and you're going to, the one holding the bite handle, you're going to push it behind your other hand, like so. And you'll see, if you do it correctly, you can get a little bit of a spin going. So to put that all together, right palm down, what you're going to do is you're going to flip the knife over the back of your hand, into your palm, thumbs up, blade towards you and over top, palm behind, like so. And that is the, basically the pushover. And so one cool thing that you can do with this move is after you finish the move, if you can try and end the fan in such a way, something like this, you can just put your palm right down and you can go right back into this move. And that's a great way to practice and really get your flow down. And so that's it. So this is a really great offhand move to, it's not even a transfer, right? It's, it never really leaves your dominant hand, but it's a nice way to get your offhand involved and um, work on your offhand proficiency a little bit. So I hope you guys like that one. Thanks for watching. Peace.